uh, I think it's really, really important that people are aware, people make others aware of what's going on. You might feel that there's nothing you can, you can do or it's such an uphill struggle, um, but, and you will be called names, you will be denigrated, you will be called all sorts of things. I mean, at the moment, it's quite bizarre because the, the type of, if you're campaigning now for those detainees um, in the camps in Syria, for them to be given due process, and if they've committed a crime or if there's evidence they've committed a crime to be put on trial, very, very identical to what we used to say about Guantanamo Bay. Mm -hmm. People who now have no problem with campaigning for, for Gitmo will still accuse you of being an ISIS you know, sympathizer or you know, pro-ISIS. So the, the blamers will always blame, and Allah tells us in the Quran, you know, don't worry about the blame of the blamers. You, know, you, you carry on doing what, the right thing and doing what you need to do. Results are in Allah's hands. Every, you know, there's that, you know, the Chinese uh, proverb, you know, if everybody picks up a pebble, the people can move mountains. I think that's sort of the, the kind of attitude we need to have. That small thing you do, whether you sign the petition, whether you uh, pressure your, your, your MP or you do attend a demonstration or you post it on social media or you write an article, all of that is going to create that pressure and create the, the climate where we'll be able to push back against the regime, the, the deprivation regime in its entirety. And in fact, it goes a step further, the, the, the anti-terror legislation in its entirety, because there is no need for it. I mean, if, if, if there's one legacy of the war on terror that's still with us and we need to get rid of, it's anti-terror laws, mm -hmm. because there's no need for them. We have perfectly capable criminal justice system, which can prosecute people for the worst crimes. We don't need these, the, the police and the state to have these draconian powers any longer. So, yeah. um, or we never had actually, but yeah. now that the fear is dissipating, we should capitalize on that and push back on this, this in its entirety.